Okay, for the next year, I'm gonna spend a lot of time talking about my use of a map, and I'm gonna be using the lingo grid squares and coordinates, and I'm gonna be talking about eight digit coordinates a lot. So let's get you up to speed. What's important when talking about grid coordinates in a land nav context to somebody that's cruising around on foot are these numbers that are in bold. Nine, six, nine, seven, nine, eight. Up the side here, we've got 25, 26, 27. I'm gonna show you this map. I've written in 87, 88, 89. Across the side here, I've got 66, 67, 68, 69. Those are important because if you look closer, you can see that there are these blue squares. These blue squares represent one square kilometer. And these numbers, 74, 75, that represents a one kilometer increase from the west to the east. And this number, 61 to 62 represents a one kilometer increase from south to north. So this box gets designated by the coordinates that represent this spot. This square gets designated by the lower left corner here, the southwestern corner. If I fold up a map, I tend to write along the margins and I also extend that line inwards. But for simplicity's sake, let's say we're talking about this box here. It's designated by its southwestern point, and that southwestern point is noted by this 77 and this 61. So we would call this 7761, and you would know I'm talking about this one square kilometer section of the map. Over here, I'm talking about 80, 61. 80, 61 is this point, but because it's a four digit grid, we're talking about one square kilometer marked by its most southwestern point. Protractors that have a ruler built into it, and those rulers are measured out for the particular scale. So this scale, is 124,000. So this will line up precisely onto these grids and allow us to measure subtensions from a thousand per grid. And here you can see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, down to the hundred meter. And if we look even closer, we can get 10 meter subdivisions in there. This map is marked with a point that's approximately 10 meters wide at right, the tip of this pen. On the lane that I like to shoot, this is a 200 meter range. Now we know here that we're in the grid square 9731. So first we need to travel to the east from this line eastward a certain distance and we can measure that with the protractor. I like to put the zero on the point and measure back. But you can see there that that blue line is right on the six tenths. So we would say that that point is nine, seven, zero, six. Then we'd measure north from the 31 line and we would see that that is on the six, two. So we would say that that is three, one, six, two. Nine, seven, zero, six. Right. And three, one, six, two. That would be our eight digit grid for that particular location.